Welcome to the Philippines, a country full of breathtaking nature and warm-hearted people. We spent one week exploring the islands Sikior and Cebu, including the amazing underwater life, beautiful beaches and breathtaking waterfalls. The nature absolutely amazed us. We saw incredible animals, enjoyed a lot of fun and adventure, and as always, tasted the local food. Join us on our travel and discover this amazing country. Starting off on Sikyo, which is a small island in the south of Cebu. We spent four days here, doing several dives for our advanced adventurer diving license and exploring the island for the rest of the time. As always, a scooter was our main means of transportation, giving us the chance to fully explore the beauty of this island. First stop here were the Kambuga High waterfalls, where we had a lot of fun with the water swing. And is attempting for a double backflip! Let's see if we can make Lucas do one full backflip until the end of the trip. We took our scooter to the middle of the island to explore Khan Devil Cave. We spent nearly two hours walking and climbing and swimming through the cave and admiring the astonishing stone and rock formations built over millions of years. Just taking a quick shower and we are off again to the next spot, the very famous ballet tree. The 400 year old ballet tree is famous for its natural spring with water flowing from the roots into a man-made pool. Tourists often stop by to marvel the tree and to enjoy a unique fish spa experience where the fish <laughs> nibble away dead skin from the feet. Many Bali trees start growing on other trees, eventually strangling and enveloping the host tree. Over time, they grow their roots down to the ground, becoming massive freestanding trees by themselves after killing the host tree. In Filipino culture, Bali trees are often related to mysterious and supernatural beings. The Boo Cafe was recommended to be the best viewpoint for the sunsets here on Sikior. Let's try it out. A new day starts and we are off again exploring the incredible Philippine underwater world. Today we started our day trip from Sikior to Apo Island, visiting the Turtle Sanctuary for another two dives and a bit of snorkeling. Heading over to Molbo on Cebu Island, which will be our base for the rest of our trip. We are on the way to Molbo. <laughs> Another tricycle ride here. This didn't stop us to spend two hours on the motorcycle to get to Oslo in the very south for one of our absolute highlights. We're going to the whale charge. We just dived with the whale sharks. 
so amazing. These huge animals just <laughs> swimming above your head. Just incredible. For sure, we needed a little snack before heading through several waterfalls back to Mole Bowl. Today we are going for some local Filipino kitchen with some tofu sizzik, some vegetable curry and then our highlight of today, a tuna steak with vegetables cooked in coconut milk. Absolutely tasty. I love it. And because two main dishes are not enough, we also got the stuffed squid here. Let's start eating. Apparently it is possible to fit four grown adults on a motorcycle as we are making our way to the starting point of the Cavazan Fall Canyoning Tour. It took us roughly half a day packed with a variety of jumps, slides and creative ways of making our way from the mountain top back to the sea. First jump, four meters! Yeah, you're reading one, two, three! <laughs> Did it! 